All right, folks, up here, gonna climb on the pole right up here. Get on the swing wall. I ain't gonna have long to fish it. It's where they let the barges come in and out. And I just passed the barge on my way up here. It's just right down there. So maybe we'll get to fish in 15 or 20 minutes. Let's pull up here and see if we can catch one. Appreciate y'all tuning in. I'm Rocky Drake. Rocky Drake outdoor. Yeah, they get them now. Lord, Lord. I'm gonna throw it right up against that wall and just let it go straight down. Just give it some slack. Just pick up, see, leave my bell open, just give it some slack. That way it'll go straight down. If you got tension on your line, it'll swing back towards the boat. And I want it to go straight down, straight down against that wall right there. Oh Lord, y'all, there's one on already. I'm not joking with you. Oh my goodness. Oh Lordy mercy. <laughs> hey. We'll put the hook on him. Oh, he ain't even got my net out yet. Lord, let me get my dip net for you and set the hook on. Because I might need it. Alright. Now let's set the hook on him. Golly! Yeah, I'd like to pull a pole out of my hand. Golly, I'm sorry about that, y'all. About the camera. Golly, this is a big in here. I'm not joking with you. Oh my goodness, what is it? Oh my goodness, look at here. You talking about oh Lord of mercy? <laughs> yeah. I mean a big spotted bass. Goodness. Look at here. Y'all like I'm sorry about that camera. Let me show you what happened. When I set the hook, that handle right there got caught in my camera. That's what happened. Good lord, y'all. That's just a that is that's a big fish. Don't y'all look at that what a chunk. Okay, let's see what it weighs. Oh lord. That fish right there weighs four pounds three ounces. That's a big spotted bass. I just pulled up here. And we done got one booger in here, weigh four pounds. Now what, what, two ounces, something like that. <laughs> We've been catching nothing. We are, <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh, look at that. I mean, that's a fine fish right there, folks. Lord have mercy. I love this right here, I showed that. I love fishing up here around these dams. If there's bait here, there's always fish hangs out up here. And you don't never know what you're gonna catch. I mean, you just don't. I mean, you lot will catch a, Spotted bass, like we just did. Like we catch small mouth bass, large mouth bass. Like we catch big stripe, big saltwater stripes. Like we catch hybrid stripes. You just don't ever know. See, they got all these floodgates open here today. I don't know if y'all can see it well, you but they got that water. Oh Lord, they got it going down there. And so it's got a lot of these fish pushed over here in this in this not so swift water. Okay, when 19 foot of water, as y'all can see right there, and the water temperature is 50 degrees. Now I just got this minnow on this little number two hook right here. I just got a couple of split shots right there. It's up by about 20 inches above the hook right there. Them split shots, what they do, they lay on the bottom. And this, this, this minnow right here, he'll swim up above them. But it gets him down there where them fish are. And it keeps them there where they at. Golly. Boy, I'll tell you what, you wouldn't want your hearing aids turned up when that thing goes off. Lord have mercy, that thing loud. What that means right there is that barge that I told y'all about is headed this way. And they're letting me, they're letting everybody know about it. Especially me, because I'm sitting right, oh, here's another one, y'all. Oh, gosh, here's another one. Oh, this feels like a big one, too. There we go. Golly, another big one. Golly, this is a real big one here. Oh, my gosh, isn't here, isn't here wanting full drag. Yep, sure is. Oh, it's getting up on the boat. Oh, come on, come on. I don't know, oh, Lord of mercy. Don't get in that trolling motor. Oh, another big one, another big one, another big one. Oh, this, I don't know what to do. Oh, Lordy mercy. Got to get in there. Look at that. There's another big one. Another good solid fish. That's a large mouth. Right there. Look at that one. There's a nice fish right there. Sure is. Beautiful fish. Healthy, healthy, healthy fish right here. Eating them many more to help. Okay. I'm just gonna keep sitting here as long as I can. Doggone. I put this put this uh, Revo on here, this Avogar Cedar. See right here. I got me some 30 pound high vis Power Pro uh, braid on there. Now that leader I channel I got on is 12 pound test mono. Let's put on, I'm gonna put on one of these thread fin sheds right here. Yep. That makes boy, that makes like two flat footed good ones right here. You gotta be real careful up here at this damn fish. A lot of things can go wrong real quick. And not only that, I think it's 800 feet of this dam right here. You got to have a life jacket on. If you don't, they will write you about a full $500 ticket. 
Oh, there he is. Oh, Lord, there he is. Oh, my God. That fish like to jerk that rod out of my hand. And we fix, we fix and introduce yourself to this one. There we go, another one. Uh, let's see what this is. Is it a big one? Oh, he's a nice one. He's a nice one. He's a nice one. He won't eat that minnow. I know that much. Oh, Lord, look here. Yeah, he's wanting that minnow. Let's turn left. Oh, they biting today, though. Oh, Lord, they biting. I can just tell already they biting. Yeah. One more good one before the barge gets here. And there he is right there. Y'all see him right there? He coming. He'll blow that big horn in a minute and let me know he's on the way. Letting me know to get out of the way. Be nice if I could snatch one more big enough out of here before he goes through there. I can feel that, that, that minnow go around that column right there when I picked up on it. And I just kind of washed around it. Oh, I got a fish. Oh, y'all, I got a big fish on here. I'm not joking with you now. I'm gonna get out of this barge's way before I set the hook. I'm gonna have to walk to the back. So I'm telling you, this is a good, this felt like a big fish. He's still on here too. No, he let it go. He done that minnow in. Look at that, see them teeth marks right there on him, on that minnow. See, he didn't have the hook in his mouth. See, what he done? See them teeth marks, he just come up and grabbed him like this. See, if I'd have set the hook, I just slid it right out of his mouth. They come up, when they grab these this bait, they'll come up behind them, grab them like that, and they'll turn them around. And when they do that, that hook's in there, and that's when you set the hook. And here comes a barge. I'm gonna pull back up here one more time. I still might get another lick at him before that barge gets here. Might. I don't get too close over there, though. Here he is, right here. He's swimming with it. Oh my goodness, this could be a, yeah. See, now there's a barge right there, coming this way, and this this fish here, there he is. Oh no, no, it's, oh my gosh, y'all, this is the biggest one of the bunch. This one here's got some weight, sure enough on it. I gotta get out of that barge's way. All right. Oh, I'm definitely gonna have to get the net on this one. Oh my goodness, what a fish. What is it, what is it? Oh my gosh, y'all, big fish, big bass. I don't know what it is, but it's a big one. Some kind of big fit, big bass. Oh my gosh. We got the barge coming in on us. This fish here is doing some serious pulling. Oh, it's a bubble fish. Get the big net. Golly, y'all. I was hoping we'd catch one. It's a bubble fish. Golly, look at this. Oh, I got him. Yeah, I got him. Oh, look at that. <laughs> yeah, I was hoping we'd get at least one more before that barge right there got here. And we did. Oh, yeah. That's a big, large mouth. We're fixing to weigh this one. That barge is right over there. I can smell the diesel coming off of it. Oh, Lord, look here. Look there, y'all. See right there? Look right here. That's four pound, 11 ounces. That's two four pounders out there. Look at that big, fat, large mouth bass. One big spot, one big large mouth. And y'all see right there? <laughs> a big barge on the way. Thank you, fish. You don't know how much I appreciate it. We just pulled that fish right there. Oh Lord, he took off. We just pulled that fish right there. Out about, we just pulled that fish right there out of 20 something foot of water. So he cold, a little bit sluggish. And uh, the bars just showed up, so uh, as soon as they get done doing what they're gonna do, <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna go over there and try to catch a nut. Hey, let's just fish a couple of these points and see what happens right now. Main thing, you gotta make sure them minnows have got some wiggle in them. So, I mean, you're not gonna catch nothing on a minnow that ain't got no wiggle. I mean, that's just a fact. There you go. I want the big horn. Oh, there's a nut and just hit it, y'all. Ain't joking with you. Is he on there? Just had another lick. That's what I like about this rod I'm using, this ducket rod right here. Now they don't make these Silverados no more, but they got another name on the same rod. What I like about these rods, and there's some other rods out there that's just as good. This just happens to be the one I got. Real sense to me. I mean, anything out on the end of that pole, if he touches that line down there, I can feel it. 
Yeah, especially if I got my finger. See, like, if I got my finger on that, uh, on there like that right there, I can show enough feel it. Oh, boy, we got nothing on y'all. I ain't joking with you, and that bar just went through. Let's see what this one is. Oh, yeah, he's swimming out here with it. Let's see what he is. That's another big one. Oh, weird. This is another big one. Oh. oh, he's pulling drag. Yeah, he's pulling drag. This is a good one here. Yes, it is. That's <laughs> going to be another bubble. Fish. <laughs> my net's way up here. Oh, my goodness. It's another big one. Oh, come here, big one. It's a big large mouth. I mean a big large mouth. Oh my gosh, look at that. Now that thing there is a butterball, so enough. Look at that joker. Look at that little hook right there. Oh Lord, just got him right there. Yep. That thing there now, I'm, oh Lord, that's gonna be the biggest one, I think. Okay, here. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm having fun now. Okay, we're gonna put him in that minor tank till I get my, oh, oh Lord, scare them minors in there to death. I just got old Bubba on, we're gonna see what this one weighs. See what this one is. Five pound. You don't see right there. Five pound, three ounces. That's that's three good ones right here. Hey, we just started fishing. Yeah. Let's catch another. Let's just see how many big jokers we can catch. Yes, sir. Look at that big thing, man. Oh Lord, how mercy, purse, folks. I'm telling you right now, boy. Woo, we we on them. Look at here. And that way, what five pounds on them anyway? Hey, three big ones are already right here. The other day I run into Richard Gene, the fish machine, my buddy, he says, you know, fishing's good for you. Well, I guarantee you it is, because right there, that's good for me. Yes, it is, folks. All right, now I'm gonna turn this fish loose, boy. Oh, Lord, look here, what a big old fat, healthy, large mouth bass here on Tennessee River. All right, let's, let her go. This wind just keeps blowing me around. I'm gonna pull back over here, and we're gonna see if we can do that again. Goodness, there's a big fish right here right now. Oh, Lord, have mercy. Oh, Lord, have mercy. Purse. Yeah. Well, I didn't take that long. I didn't take that barge that long to go through there. Now let's see if it affected the fish bite right here. Probably. I don't. I don't think it's going to. I'm gonna spot lock it right here. This spot lock trolling motor. I'm gonna tell you right now. Boy, it saves you a lot of aggravation, a lot of time when you're fishing, especially in this current, especially in the wind, especially when you're on the place and they bite and you don't want to get off of. It. Oh, there's another. Oh, Lord. I'm telling you right now. There's another, y'all. Oh, let's see. See, look there. See? Look down at my pole. See it right there? He's swimming with it right here. Ain't no telling how big this joker's going to be. There's another big one. Oh, my goodness. Another big one. Another good one. Oh, yeah. No, well, this thing's big. I can flip him up here. But he's a good one. Yeah. I'm going to see if we can catch five big ones right here. I mean, five, when I say big fish to me, you know, a four pound uh, bass, any kind of a four pound spotted bass or a small mouth bass, even a large mouth, that's pretty good fish. Last big one I caught was just right there. Oh, we got nothing on here. I ain't joking with y'all. I ain't joking, y'all. No, I ain't joking with you now. I'm telling you right now, we got nothing on. It feels like a big heavy fish too. It's just right down there on that boat right there. Oh Lord, have mercy. He's swimming over through here. We'll see him right here. Let's just, let's hope we can get a hook in. There he is. Uh, this one don't feel as big. Nope, it ain't any big. Now, don't you ever look at that little old bitty fish right there, that big old man. Ain't that something? I'm gonna throw one of these thread fins down there just to see, and I'm gonna hook him the same way. Uh, like I say, I'm thinking they're they're favoring them uh, gizzard chat. The only problem with these thread fin shad, when this water's real cold like it is, about 50 degrees, they just, they more look What's that word? Uh, well, let me put the lajardic. Now this ain't got a lot of wiggle in them. I just put it to you like that. But and them gizzard shad are right the opposite. Them gizzard shad they got a lot of wiggle in them. So let's fish with this thread fin here just a minute and see if there's a fish down there that uh, likes thread fin shad. These fish are eating today. I'm doing, I, and I'm surprised because I, this is the day after a, we had a major front blow through here last night. I'm talking about rain and cold and windy and all that good stuff. And I didn't really think they would bite that good today, but they are. 
that's the thing about this bait I'm using, this, this all natural swim bait like I'm using. Even if they ain't hungry, a lot of times they'll still eat these, these, uh, this bait right here like I'm fishing with. Still ain't got no sniff. If they come up there and they sniff it, more than likely they're gonna eat it. Okay, now I'm gonna try something. I'm gonna put this showing up big gizzard shadow. Look at that big joker. There's some fish down there big enough to eat it, I can tell you that much. Oh, there's one on it. Oh yeah, he's on there. Let's throw the slack up and see what we got. Yeah, we got it. That's a good one. Oh my gosh. Look at what one. Oh, another big bubble fish for sure. Oh my gosh. Gosh. Y'all see him jump. Oh my gosh, y'all. Yeah. Another big bubble. Oh Lord. Come up and get in that. Get in that net, you big hound dog. Yes, sir, buddy. Oh, we're going to have to bubble this one. Ain't no doubt about that. Let's see what this one's going to weigh. Smash that little button right there, boy. Oh, Lord have mercy. Okay, zero, zero, zero. Let's see what this one weighs. There's a nothing over four. What's it going to do? It'll lock in. Four pound, one ounce. See right, John? <laughs> oh, Lord have mercy. That makes four of them over four right now. Look at that fish, y'all. Look what a pretty fish. Yeah. Let's just turn that and loose. Oh, see that boy, Lord. Turn them fish loose, folks. Somebody else can catch them. Y'all can tell it's raining. And I'm heading back down to the round, folks. Appreciate y'all tuning in. Right. We'll catch you next time. Yeah. Go with.